What's good, y'all? It's your leak, so we are back with another video. If you want to go crazy on Quincy Hakata, now is the time because this build is nearly unstoppable. But before we get into the video, I am on the road to 10,000 subscribers, so I'd really appreciate if you hit that sub button. I drop a ton of type soul content. Leave a like on this video if it helps you out. Let's get straight into it, man. Okay, guys, so first things first, you're going to want to go ahead and copy exactly of what I have one through nine guys because all of these all combo within each other besides the skill box move which is on my dash button which is death flare guys you might need a skill box to pop that extra little bit of the combo and get the cooldown for rising shot so if you don't have this move it might trouble you just a little bit so just go grind some raids bro skill boxes are actually really common to get right now Okay, guys, now going over the stats for this build. We are running 50 Hakata. Yes, you need all of these moves. It is going to be very important, especially Spine Rend, which is the level 50 Hakata move. And then, y'all already know, I need Bloomy Cut in every build for them runners, man. For them people who don't want the smoke, we got to catch them, bro. So we got 12 speed on this build, and we are running three medic which you do not need guys you can put that in safeguard you can put it into speed and get that flash step mastery too which i might actually just do right now while i'm thinking about it but i got medic just so i can heal some of my friends in raids that we were doing but yeah i'd probably just go 15 speed or throw that three into safeguard and you'll be set with those stats right there now going into how exactly you're gonna want to combo these moves warden is gonna be pretty helpful so for my quincy's out there i do recommend you roll your weapon and get warden which is the one with the chains and you could actually pull them in you're gonna go rising shot pulse and negation which is just one two three it is not that hard guys that's why i'm telling you guys to copy my exact keybinds and then you're gonna want to go ahead and crit them with your chains which is going to give you a little bit more time for your cooldowns straight into a death flare which you need to get guys if you don't have death flare then go into tour of reach if you do use your death flare tour of reach spine rend and you should have your rising shot a hundred percent of the time if you are landing this properly and then you could go ahead and go into a demonic embrace straight into the catching dragon which they're gonna be stunned completely and then you could rising shot them again and of course guys i do know this is blockable i do know it's possible but on a lot of players you can catch them off guard a lot of people don't know how to play against hakata right now because it's so busted nobody's expecting two bar combos three bar combos to be happening but yes this build is actually insane. I would not lie to you guys. Once again, guys, I am trying to hit 10,000 subscribers. So I'd really appreciate it if you smash that sub button. I'm going to catch you on the next one. Leave a like on this video if this helped you out in any way. It's Elixo. Peace.